It is another rainy day outside, so I thought I'd record a video of a new pedal by Digitech called the Time Bender. The pedal is a musical delay, and what I mean by that you will see in the following sections. When you look at other pedals, you will see that there is a modulation delay next to other delay types. Digitech is offering a modulation feature on each and every delay type which is incorporated in the time bender. Just dial in the type you want, the type of delay you want, and add modulation using uh, the knob here. Modulation knob, okay? Hope you can see that. For example, you want modulation on the analog delay. Dial in the analog delay. Or maybe on the digital delay. The mix control is responsible for the amount of delay signal you hear in the outputs. All the way to the left you hear no effect signal, just your tri guitar. As you turn it up you get more delay as you go along and all the way to the right you hear no tri guitar, just pure effect signal. If you are not in memory mode. If you are in tempo mode, you can use the tempo slash memory food switch to set the tempo of the delay. The time bender has an infinite repeat function, so if you have something going on in the feedback loop, you can hold down the left foot switch and freeze that last phrase, which is in the feedback loop at this moment, just like this. The repeat knob lets you select the amount of feedback. All the way to the left, you have just one repeat. And all the way to the right, the repeats are infinite. And because the signal will be constantly fed back into the input, the output signal will get louder and louder. So make sure you control the overall volume, okay? Digitech features a spillover function on the time bender. That means if I switch off the pedal, the delay will still finish its cycles.
This was an example of the tone control. The tone control is responsible for the sound the delay throwing back at you. You can use it as a tone filter. Listen to that. To wrap this presentation up, I just go through various delay types so you know what to expect from the time bender, and I start with a digital delay. This is the analog delay now. And you can hear the repeats will wash out in sonic quality as you go along. Here's an example of the dynamic repeat type. This is an example for the envelope type. This is also an example of the envelope type. These are a couple of examples of the time warp type. I have not even touched the harmony feature on the time bender. <laughs> 